Alexa, take me to the planet Venus with my 12-inch Dobsonian and both cameras, the ZWO-224 and the ZWO-294. I want to compare those images. Tiago, I can't do it. I'm sorry. You have to do it yourself, manually. Doesn't matter. Okay? I will not lose all the fun to do it anyway. Venus surface is super hot and there are more volcanoes on Venus than in other planet on the solar system. So Venus is there and we'll try to catch it with a 12 inch Dobsonian. Let's do it. I've started with a ZWO224 camera and using the shark cap as usual and I was careful to lower the exposures enough to have the planet with a nice view. This is important. I've also used the um, region of interest technique as I explained in other videos like the Jupiter or Saturn planetary imaging which you can see in my playlist. And then I picked the 294 camera and I did exactly the same as before with the 224. I pointed to Venus and record a video. But first I had to struggle a bit. <laughs> Don't think this was a piece of cake. No, I had to get focus, to get the proper balance. The planet is too low in the sky, so the, the balance of the dob uh, has to be perfect. Get a good framing and doing all that stuff. I was enjoying the moment and of course the night came. But all of that worth it especially with the beautiful images you will see in a moment. And then I processed the file as usual with the same technique I exposed in those videos on my channel in the astrophotography playlist. You should check it out. Please subscribe and give it a like! Basically what my kids are saying is for you to take advantage of my experiences in these videos, subscribing to the channel and also to give it a like to boost the video performance in the search of YouTube and reach more people of course. And here they are, both Venus images side by side. The smaller one is the 294 because of the large field of view this camera has. Tell me in the comments if you also captured Venus and click on this video if you want to know all the steps I used to capture these images.